Hi, my name is Nancy Rogers. I live in Montague, California, and I create custom leather work made to your specifications. Yes, everything is handmade. I run the entire business. I am a one-person business. Um, Ace High Leathers was created by me. We converted our double car garage into my shop, and which houses both of our motorcycles and all of my tools and my ton of leather. And basically it's like taking a blank canvas, except my canvas is leather. And I choose the color and then I create from there. I do just about anything anybody orders, but at this point my specialty is motorcycles. I do western wear also, like chaps and I do holsters and cartridge belts and some articles of that nature but basically I just mostly work with the motorcyclists in our world. For me it's I do I do more than just leather work I touch people I get to talk to them I put smiles on their faces working with the motorcyclist it's always something fun because it's either something that they need for their motorcycles to make their trips more enjoyable or it's just something they want to embellish their bikes with to look a little bit nicer. What I do is all about fun. I really love what I do. It's a passion. Money works and it's good. Um, do I make a ton of money doing this? No. Could I? Sure, if I wanted to outsource to possibly other countries or um, maybe pay people very little per hour, but I believe I'm a little bit selfish. I like the one-on-one -on -one contact with my customers. One of the reasons I started this was because I was out of work. When I started thinking about going to work for somebody else again, it bothered me in the pit of my stomach. Um, and my husband said that I had worked at so many jobs where I had increased uh, business for people and that I was great at promoting, promoting other people's business. And he said, point blank, why don't you promote your own business? And so that's where I started. The day I invested $3,000 in a sewing machine, I was scared to death because I didn't know how I was ever going to uh, make the money back. And it just keeps getting better. Orders keep getting bigger. People keep contacting me from other countries, and I just take care of people one order at a time. One of the things I like about my work is the fact that I take cowhide or lambskin or pig suede or pig hide, and I use it. We have an excess of cattle grown in the United States, and I know that the methane gas produced from the cattle is affecting our atmosphere. As one person, I can't stop all of that, but I can't put to use just one more piece of the animal and make something useful out of something that's already had his life extinguished. And for that, I hold a very deep respect to the, the animals that, uh, whose hides I work with. What triggered the ethic for my work and for my train of thought came to me years ago. I don't know where it came from. I don't know when. I'm sure I heard it somewhere. But um, I believe in a higher power. Uh, call it what you want. I'll call it God because that's pretty much what I was raised with. But I really do believe that what you, you know, you're God's gift to the world. You're a very precious gift that's here. What you make of yourself is, is your gift to God. So I give back to the world and I give back to those people every time I take a shipment and get it ready to go. To me that's just giving back. It's scattered to me. It's almost like fairy dust. I've got little pieces of leather that look really pretty all over the world. And I like that. It's fun. 